this new indication uh, approved by the FDA is really exciting news for us here at uh, Kite Pharmaceuticals. Um, back in 2017, Kite was approved for a large B-cell lymphoma in the third line setting. But this new indication approved by the FDA last week actually expands usage into the second line setting. Uh, which basically means that more patients can get access to therapy. In fact, we are effectively doubling the eligible patients that can get access now to Escarta, and it also means that these patients can get access to these therapies earlier, which means they may have better outcomes. I think it adds to the growing body of evidence for CAR-T therapies in general. Um, if you take a look at our second line approval, it really builds on our Zuma-1 data, which was in third line LBCL, and now we have industry-leading five-year data that shows that 43% of patients are alive after five years. And of those, 92% of patients actually do not need or didn't need additional cancer therapies during this time, which is really incredible. If you combine that with the fact that we've got additional indications in follicular lymphoma and with Tocardis, we're in MCL and also in ALL, um, the growing portfolio that we have here at Kite is really established in CAR-T therapy. is not some science fiction treatment, but actually something that's really well established in the mainstream of medicine that can help a lot of patients. Well, I think our number one goal right now with this exciting new indication is to ensure that we get the word out and that we ensure that every eligible patient that could benefit from these CAR-T therapies like Yescarta actually get access to them. Um, we've done some market research and unfortunately, only two out of 10 patients that are eligible for CAR-T therapies right now are actually receiving them. So we've got some work to do in terms of reaching out to the community, ensuring that we educate our physicians, ensuring that we raise awareness with patients and their caregivers about the life-changing and life-altering uh, possibilities of CAR-T therapy, and ensuring that we increase their ability to get access to these wonderful therapies.